Welcome to Star Rock State Park. My name is Lisa Sons and I am a Natural Resource Coordinator for the Illinois Department of Natural Resources on site at Star Rock and Matheson State Parks. Today we're going to talk about trail tips and this is going to be part of a series discussing different trail suggestions for first time visitors or even repeat visitors. The eastern canyons such as Illinois, Ottawa, and Kaskaskia offer one mile round trip hikes to visitors who park in those designated canyon lots along Route 71. Make sure to wear sturdy hiking boots and be prepared to cross several creek crossings and a few muddy trails. One of the only areas in the park where visitors do not have to climb up and down major staircases. Illinois Canyon is the place to be in the spring when masses of Virginia bluebells blanket the forest floor as eastern Phoebes sing their name from the treetops. Illinois Canyon may have the smallest waterfall at a height of a few feet, but it is the widest and longest canyon in the park. The Illinois Canyon Trail connects to the Ottawa and Kaskaskia Trail system along the Illinois parking area. Crossing over to Ottawa and Kaskaskia Canyons, look for wild hydrangea growing along the trails mixed in with witch hazel and dogwood. In spring, pockets of nodding trillium delight visitors along the trail. Not a true cave, Council Overhang is a very unique geological feature and Native American site at the park. Archaeologists discovered human activity in this area as far back as 10,000 years or the Archaic period. Just past the overhang, take a right and follow the creek back into Ottawa Canyon and Waterfall. Listen for water thrushes along the way. Take the same trail out of Ottawa and turn right to follow the creek back to Kaskaskia Canyon, my personal favorite canyon and waterfall in the park. Some visitors have been fortunate enough to observe barred owlets fledge amongst the tall oaks in spring. Thank you for walking the trails with us today. Happy trails! <laughs>